Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you all are doing well. I'm in Armadillo Smile about a bunch of guys caskets. And in this video, I'm gonna run through the Armadillo All Hollows Call to Arm. And so I'll give you a couple of twip tips that will help you survive all the way to the end. But before I get into that, man, if you enjoy this type of content, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Continue to help me grow. Also, do me a favor hit the notification bell so that you are alerted next time that I drop a new video. Now that that's out of the way, yo, let's get right into it. All right, guys, so I'm gonna give you a couple of tips that will help you survive the armadillo all hollows called arms. And I'll do a couple of rounds so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. So let's get right into the call to arms. I think I remember I liked armadillo because it had high ground. I'm just gonna leave all these guys right here and focus on get up here. Let's go to the back. Get up here. Go this way. I like this roof. Even though you can get tomahawked, I still like this roof. Boat action. Now they are going to come from everywhere. They're gonna come from all over there. Especially back here. And all through here. You're gonna have snipers on that end over there and over there so you kind of have to be real careful but this roof is great because it has great coverage and it gives you the high ground but it does not protect you from the tomahawks so you got to watch out for those too so we just inviting them here huh the seance right there so we doing okay there go buddy right there he needs to get on the roof need to get some high ground let's see if he tries to follow me and get some high ground hopefully he does but Maybe he won't. Now, also when you up up here, they will climb on this little awning right there, so you got to look out from that as well. Good job. Oh, never mind. He <laughs> fell right off. <laughs> so you watch all those locations, and then hunker up here. You'll be able to get through it, no problem. Man, I forget it gets real dark. Now, I could have also moved the wagon. Oh, they're dropping already. Nice, nice. So those are machete ladies, you gotta watch out for them too. Those machetes are nothing nice. You see, they all come running this direction. Help that guy out a little bit. There you go, I see you. Nope, he got him. Cool, now look, everybody's still white, so there's no need to go down and heal anybody, we're good. But when it gets low, you're gonna have to get down and heal your help because you're gonna need them if you wanna ride this wave and make it all the way to 10. Cause they're gonna come heavy, man. I'm telling you, they're gonna come heavy. Now, I know I'm allowed to come in with my posse because then we have four and then we'll have a couple at the top and then we'll have one person designated to run down and heal everybody. And then when it gets to later rounds, we have two people go down so that two people can stay up and cover. We have a posse. It's great to work in tandem like that. But if you're riding just deuces, gotta make it work. Gotta make it work. Come on, where you guys at? Ah, oh, they shoot him over there. He's kind of up under me, so I can't get him. Thank you. 
They are airing them out over there. Oh, they started running fast now. Help her out. Get down. He's running and gunning. Oh, they all coming from back there. Oh, he's directly up under me. So now hopefully he's going over there to heal those guys. I'll hop down and heal this guy back here. I got the high ground, Anakin. Drop him. Nope. Not today. Are they behind me now? Oh, they're running up on Buddy. Oh, the Tomahawk guy. They already throwing tomahawks? Ooh, was that another one? Ooh, like that right through this little frame. Ooh, I missed him. Oh, we lost our ally because they started throwing them Dang on Tomahawks. I think our buddy went down. And I think we riding so low dolo. Oh, he back up now. Yeah, he went down. Okay. Tomahawks, see, look at them. Tomahawks coming. Hate them Tomahawks, guys. Hate them with a passion. Is throwing them tomahawks. <laughs> you know, she is trying to give me look at them tomahawks in the roof. <laughs> she went playing no games. Okay. Not today. All right. Also, any new players, if you're up here or you're in the Hall of Arms and then you're walking around and it seems like your guy's getting dizzy, that means somebody is trying to snipe you from far away, like a sniper and or in this instance a chick with a tomahawk so you want to be looking around get down because if you get hit you will fall and it will be curtains for you all right guys that is it for this one if you follow those tips you'll be able to survive armadillo no problem armadillo is a pretty easy one to do because you have a lot of tall buildings with high ground pick any one you like like i said i like that one up right there because it has that cover in the back and you could duck down and you can still hit everything around you and some that is right up under you but most importantly you gotta watch out for the tomahawk people because they will come out in an abundance and if you get hit with one it is curtains for you you are done and you will have to start over so make sure you're popping those potions so that if you get hit with a tomahawk you may survive the first hit so that you can stay alive and um take another potion so you'll be able to stay alive so you want to make sure that you always start around popping a potion especially with the tomahawk people out but that's what's going to give you the most trouble in armadillo is the tomahawk because they will one shot you but other than that man if you stay on the high ground keep your potions uh full yellow and keep your support al alive as long as you can you will survive armadillo and you will survive the apocalypse no problem no worries but that's it for this one hope it was helpful in some way shape or form if it was man do me a favor and hit the subscribe button continue to help me grow 
Also, do me a huge favor and hit the like button and let the YouTube algorithm know that you enjoy this type of content so that they shoot it out for others who would let, might enjoy this content as well. Do me one more big favor, man. Hit the notification bell so that you are alerted the next time that I drop a new video. That's it. Survive the zombie apocalypse and get all that gold and all that money. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side.